If you're new to Squarespace and trying to get a blog going on your website, then you might be really frustrated. Hi, I'm Brian with Abound Web Design here with another Squarespace tutorial for you. And today we're going to be talking about getting images added to your blog post. In the classic editor, which is used on blog post within Squarespace, the process of adding images or videos or really anything, any blocks to the blog post is completely dif different than it is on the rest of your website because the rest of your website uses Fluid Engine and blog posts use the classic editor. The reason behind this is because blog posts are generally pretty heavy in text and Squarespace hasn't really found a way to make the Fluid Engine editor work well in those text heavy areas. So I'm going to show you how to how to add images to your blog post and then even like stack the stack the images multiple images beside each other or stacking images beside text so let's head on over to my screen and i'll show you step by step how to do this right now okay so right away let's just jump into edit mode here and i'm going to show you what we're talking about with and you already know this part whatever but you know adding an image block in fluid engine is super easy you just click add block click image and then there it is and you can just drag it and move it wherever you want to. Super simple. Not quite the same with the classic editor, which you're going to be using for blog posts. So let's head over to go to pages and then down to, I've got the blog in the not link section on this demo website. We will click on the blog and then let's just go into one of these specific blog posts. So we'll go into blog post one here and we've got some filler text there. Okay, so let's go ahead and go into edit mode here. And then when you scroll down, you're going to see you have these plus buttons for you to be able to add. You have what you have there essentially is for three text blocks. So to be able to add a block, you know, above the text here or below the text here, you would just click the plus button. So let's add an image below this first paragraph here. And so we would hit the plus and then now we're just going to click image, which feels familiar to Fluid Engine. That's very similar, but now it, it was where it start, starts operating a little bit differently. So you can see here the image block is way bigger than what it would be in Fluid Engine. It goes through you know the complete width of the text and takes up that entire space between the first paragraph and the second paragraph. And then the other thing is let's go ahead, let's go ahead and get an image added. So let's hit the plus. When you hit the plus, you have an option to upload a image file from your computer from the Squarespace library, or we're just going to use stock images. So we'll open that up and then we'll just use this picture of this person standing in front of, or at the top of like a, it looks like a ski slope there. So we'll add that and give it a second to load. And you notice one of the things here is that you have the option to have a caption below, because that's something that people do a lot when they post an image in a blog is to have a caption below of, what the you know what the picture is but for us let's just turn it off and then we'll click off of that settings box there for the image and you'll see what it looks like here now if you want this image to actually be smaller you're either going to have to stack it beside text or you're going to have to stack it beside another image or just some other block is going to be stacked beside it to be able to change the size of this so to do that we're going to let's just start with stacking images so we'll stack another picture beside this one. So we'll hit the plus here, click image again, click the plus to add an image. We'll just browse some stock images again. Let's just, let's go ahead and do the, the other, the picture of the mountain there. We'll go ahead and turn the caption off. And then you'll see the images on, you know, one on top of the other. Now, if you wanted them stacked beside each other, all you have to do is simply click, we'll click the bottom image and we'll drag it beside the other one here and now you have the two images there so if you wanted to change if you wanted to stack the image beside text you can bring that down and you see how you have to get the block there if you you can put it below it you can put it beside everything there again and you see it, it stacks the image to the side and all text on the left there. But if you wanted to stack it just beside this text here, you 
you do that and then now you get the full image there you get the first paragraph the full image there and then you get this text with the image beside it so it's just a matter of dragging the block around until it pops into place beside the other block that you want to stack it next to that's all there is to it if you found this useful please leave a like so others can find squarespace content like this and subscribe if you want more videos like this one and if you'd like me to build your Squarespace website for you, you can find my contact information in the description below.